such prolonged bed rest. Please tell me you brought some Rocky Road and a cheeseburger. You just came by to test your muscle tone again. You know, fries? Well, at least you're not Dr. Shalansky. He brings tours in here like I'm some freak from Wild Animal Park. He's excited that you're awake. He's alive. He's alive. Excuse me. <laughs> okay, that feels a little stronger than last week. Try to lift up your leg. It's good. Very good. Well, it's more than you could do the last time. That's thanks to three hours a day with Helga, the therapist from hell. Ooh, I see you had some visitors. Yeah, that was my best friend from college. I haven't seen her since graduation. I asked her for a joint and she brought me a teddy bear. Well, that's good for her. The last thing we need is to take anything that will interfere with your recovery. I need to take the edge off. Waking up and finding out that your mom's dead and your fiance is MIA and you've literally slept through your 20s is just a little stressful. <sighs> Has Dr. Shalansky said anything about the accident? All I know is you and your mom were driving into some kind of traffic collision. Yeah, that much I remember. You were on our way for my final fitting for my wedding dress. It was strapless. With a tube skirt. <laughs> I wouldn't even let Jason see it. Your fiance? Mm hmm. You spoken to him? Oh, that would fall under the heading of scared as hell. Don't know how to do that one. <laughs> Lower title bottom.